welcome to our lesson on square and cube numbers. A square number is a number multiplied by itself, but we can also think of it as an area of a square. So a first square number is a square of length one by one, and you can see there is one square. We can think of the second square number as a square of two by two, and you can see we have four squares. The third square number is a three by three square, where we have nine squares. We can also calculate the square numbers as the area of a square, which is in this case, four multiplied by four, or four times by itself, which is 16. The fifth square number would be the number of squares here. And we can calculate that as five squared which is 25. The sixth square number, rather than counting all of these, we can just do six times six, or six squared, which is 36. Do you want to try and work out the seventh, eighth, ninth, and tenth square numbers by pausing the video, and you can resume it when you're ready. Okay, the seventh square number is seven squared, which is seven times seven, and that is 49. The eighth square number is eight times eight, which is 64. The ninth square number is nine times nine, 81. And the tenth square number is 10 times 10, which is 100. To work out square numbers on a calculator, we can use this button here. So for 13 squared, we would do 13 and then we will press the squared button and we get 169 Do you want to try and work out 1.5 squared by pausing the video and you can resume it when you're ready 1.5 and then the squared button and that is 2.25 For question C, this symbol here means square root and this is the opposite of something squared. So for instance, if you look at this square here, we have a area of four, and the square root will give you the length by doing the square root of four, and that will give you the length of two. So if we did the square root of nine, we would get the length of this square as three. The square root of 16, four. So do you want to try and work out the square root of 196 and 256 using this button here? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. Okay, so the square root of 196 is 14 and the square root of 256 is 16. Okay, let's move on to cube numbers. We can work out the first few cube numbers by considering the volume of their cubes. So for instance, we have a cube of one by one by one, which has one cube. So our first cube number is one. The second cube number, we have eight cubes in total here. So the second cube number is two times two times two, which is eight. And the third cube number, is the number of cubes in this diagram, which is 27, or three times three times three. The fourth cube number we can work out as four cubed, which is 64. And the fifth cube number is 125. Do you want to try and work out the 6th, 7th and 8th cube numbers by pausing the video and you can resume it when you're ready. So 6 cubed is 216. 7 cubed is 343. And 8 cubed is 512. Because 8 cubed is 512, the cube root of 512 is 8. 
you want to try and work out question A, B, C and D by pausing the video and you can resume it when you're ready. Okay, for question A, 7 cubed is 343, 0.8 cubed is 0.512, the cube root of 3375 is 15, and finally for question D, the cube root of 68.9 is 4.1 to 1 decimal place. Okay, thank you for watching and I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care.